How you doing? This is Ivan with Bite Size Wisdom for Busy People. And I'm back with another quote of the day to have a great day. I know it's been a while since my last post. I've just been busy with life. My wife, she is currently pregnant with our first child. So that's the most important priority for us right now. We're super excited and we feel super blessed. Anyway, I'll try to produce more regular content going forward. Hopefully, there's still a few of you guys out there that are still listening and who still find my content to be useful. All right, guys, so today our quote is by Sir Francis Bacon. The quote is, in charity, there is no excess. If you're on a self-development or spiritual journey, much of that journey at times can seem selfish as you are mainly focused on yourself which can be okay because in order to truly help others, we must be able to help ourselves first. This will also help us to relate to other people's struggles and then we are also in a better position to help others by having some personal experience and insight into their situation. Initially, a lot of our inner work though is learning to not inwardly consider and dwell on what we think others think about us. To not become identified with our negative inner states, which may arise as a result of considering how our self-image is hurt by what we think others think about us. It's one of our biggest energy leakages that prevents us from growing, from evolving, Another dimension of our self-development work is just learning to consider others more. This means learning to put ourselves in other people's shoes. As we progress on our self-development journey, we really can learn to intuitively sense what another person may be thinking and feeling. Then, when we are in certain situations, we don't think about what is the best outcome only for us. We think about what may be the best response, which also includes the other. We learn that by serving the needs of others first, the byproduct is that ultimately we are also serving ourselves. By becoming more compassionate and more wise, this is how real acts of charity in the past helped you to act selfless, to go beyond your egoic mind, your egoic tendencies, and at the same time, it gave you deep inner fulfillment. So, as you go along on your journey through life, learn to worry less about what others think about you. First of all, people don't think about you as much as you think they do. And second, it's usually not very accurate. And if you find out that it is, just inwardly thank them if they have helped you to see an undesirable element of your personality that now you can work on diminishing. Now that you're conscious of it, you can actually do something about it. And third, it's only a waste of energy that doesn't do anything useful for, useful for you but is actually quite damaging on many levels. So just learn to try to consider others more by doing what you think is in their best interest and not only yours. I'm also not saying that you need to get out there and save the world or to be the next Mother Teresa. Just learn to be a little more helpful to others in whatever way you are able and within your capability. By helping others, you're ultimately helping yourself and there are no limits to the real benefits you will receive, like the quote says. Pay it forward, as they say. And if we all learn to be a little more considerate of others, the world will be much better for everybody. All right, guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed today's little quote. If you did, help me out and just share with anyone who may find it useful. And I hope you guys are doing well. Take care, and until next time, peace.